Hi morning guys, I'm out with uh, Mandy, first aid back digging for how long? Five weeks? Hey. Uh, we've been invited out by uh, Stevie Bob today. He's down there, look at it. Thank you very much Stevie. Um, we're on a, one of his permissions out in the uh, leak area. Um, I know he doesn't mind me filming, so uh, that's a bit of a We've only been here, what, half an hour, an hour? No, we've only been here an hour. Right, excuse the wind if it's windy. Uh, right, I've had a pen knife. That was just down there. Uh, a few cow tubes on the way up to here. Uh, but here, in this hole here, I've just had this. Now, I don't know if you can see the detail on it, but... I haven't got a clue what it is. But I'm thinking it's old. I don't know if that's a ship, I don't know if it's a um, tent with a flag on top, up there. Uh, all I know is it's bloody old. And uh, I don't know when I was looking on this side, I thought I made out a head or something, but it could just be flat. So I don't know. But uh, if anyone knows what that is, it's uh, really interesting. It's really old, might even be Roman, I don't know, might even be Celtic, that looks like a rabbit there, a rabbit there, an eye, eyeball there, I don't know, but uh, if you do know, let me know, right, I've got a picture of it, I'll see you next, see you in a bit, see you in a bit man, yeah she hasn't been digging for about five weeks because of the operation on her hand, <laughs> <laughs> right, see you in a bit. Hi guys, uh, sorry about the wind. Uh, just come down here now, just had a dig in this mud here. Uh, I think just had a big buckle. I don't think it's very old. Uh, it looks a bit too industrial to me. <laughs> so, that'll be a 1900 buckle. There you go. I don't think it's an old one. Alright. Let's crack on. See you in a minute. Right guys, just a quick update. Uh, there's Steve up there. I think Mandy's just decided to nip into that field there. Um, right, sorry about the wind again. Yeah, the little thing I found uh, earlier on. That. Uh, I put it on Facebook earlier. And it turns out it's a... Quarter gold noble coin weight, so dating around about the 1400s, 1420s, something like that onwards. So, yeah, that's for me, that's a cool find that's made my day. I'll show you the rest of the stuff I've had. I've had a bit of a ring, well, it's, it's I don't think it's um, an olive, but it looks, more, it looks more like a ring than an olive. A uh, bit of decorative copper and buttons, that's all I've had today. Um, but I'm not complaining, Mandy's had a nice spindle wall, Steve's had a nice spindle wall as well. Um, it's just nice to get out, I suppose. So I'm going to have a bit, little uh, hour in there, I think, and then I think we're going after that. Right, let's carry on. I'll see you at the next. Hi guys, uh, we're coming to a different field now. Um, sorry about the wind, I don't know where the bike is on here, but anyway, there's Mandy. Resting around. <laughs> I think I've had my first, well, I have had my first clean of the day. Uh, right down there, well deep. Uh, you can just see in there, it's an old Georgie third. So, three ones up there. Uh, round about, what, well, 70 cent is on this side. That one. I won't get a date off that, it's knackered. But uh, yeah, cool. First coin of the day. Get in. Right, let's carry on. I'll see you in a minute. Hi, morning everybody. Uh, out on a club dig this morning. Uh, it's the 13th of March. 
Uh, quite a few people here today. Manda's around somewhere. Uh, there's Mr. Lee's. I think Rich Bessie's around somewhere. There's John Edwards. Hi, John. Uh, Fubar, Craig. Uh, Cromwell's here as well. Um, who else? Anyway, doesn't matter. Right, started up here. Got myself in a bit of a pocket watch. It's not gold, it's not silver. Cool though. Uh, couldn't, there's nothing else in the hole. Uh, that button. And a bit of a manky old spoon, I think. This probably goes back to the 1600s. But anyway, from this hole here, that's just popped out. Thought it was a coin at first, but it, it's not. When you look on that side, it's probably got some kind of commemorative token. I'm guessing George the Fifth, maybe. Not even looked at the other side yet. That's got a nice big shield on it. So, uh, yeah, that's cool. Got some stuff it's enough at the top. So I'll get that cleaned up and uh, show you some pictures of that. See what it says on the edge. That's a cool find, that latter. Right, let's we'll carry on. See you in a minute. Hey look guys, there's Manda. Give us a wave. <laughs> right, coming to a different field now. Uh, come down from there. I've uh, dug a couple of little bullets, a few bits of lead. Uh, so a belting target here now. And if you look down in the hole there, that's looking like a cartwheel penny there, and I've not had it out yet. So uh, we'll get it out. Oh, I might have a bit of detail on it as well. Oh, this one. No, it's got no detail on it. You never have. <laughs> Give it a rub. Right. Yeah, it's definitely a George. It's a George up there. Oh, dear. It's a lovely day today. The sun's out. It's beautiful. It's gonna be red all later. Right then. Yeah, George the third, Cartwheel Penny 1797. It's normally standard date on them. Can't wait to figure out which way he's up there as well. There's a little fork. So yeah, cool. Date at the bottom, 1797. You'll see it there. Cool. Alright, let's carry on to the next. Bloody flies just going up my nose. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you in a minute. Hey up guys, uh, not long after I had that uh, cartwheel penny, it was only just over there. I uh, just had a good target here you now. And all the guns flip the sod up. Check that out. I think we might have silver, you can see where it was sitting in the hole. I've not touched it yet, so I don't know what it says. So we'll get it out together. Definitely looks silver to me, that. Come on. Look at that. Yep, it's looking like a Vicky. Yep, Vicky 6 shilling, is it? Vicky shilling. That looks lovely, that. Queen Victoria, one shilling, let's get a date. Uh, 1845. Sweet, you see where it was there, look here. And it's called Dugger again on here. Right, Balting Target that was as well. Alright, let's carry on. See you in a minute. I do guys, uh, just had a uh, target here now, 
That's my mate Craig. All right, Craig, four king diggers. Yep. Give them a subscribe and go on the dig. Are we fully booked, yeah? Uh, no, still more places if anybody wants them. Uh, Fourkingdiggers at gmail.com. Just give it a email. Awesomeness. That's Carlos, the Hammy King. <laughs> <laughs> well, as Craig says, this is the sad part of the video. <laughs> I've just had this uh, pigeon ring. There's the number AO1462. Great Britain 2001. And as Craig would say, Beard's dead, mate. Beard is dead. Never to be seen again. Right, let's crack on. I'll see you in a bit. There's Mandy. Alright, I'll see you on the next one.